What's up YouTube family? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. It's a little bit late right now where I'm at, but guess what? I'm craving some wings and I'm craving some vegan ranch or just ranch in general. And we know that it can either go two ways. I can get the real ranch and why? Or I could just veganize it because I don't want to obliterate my intestines. I like my intestines. I've got my cashews that are already soaking. These are just whole cashews, non-salted or anything. I got my fresh dill, chives, black pepper, my little baby little garlic right there looking all cute. I got my pink Himalayan sea salt. And normally when I make this, I use a little bit more lemon, but this is all I have in the crib right now. So this will do because I really want to make this ranch. And I also got my almond milk. It doesn't matter what kind you got. This is just personally the kind that I have. First step of course is to strain the cashews. If y'all don't know that man, drop it in the blender. And now I'm gonna add the dill. And I'm not measuring because <laughs> you know how we do it on this side, baby. Take a handful of chives, drop it in there, why not? Drop the little baby garlic in there too. Bloop. All right, so now it's time to get these wings. <laughs> First step is to get some flowers. See what we got here? Uh. I got some organic all-purpose flour. I've already got the broccoli and the cauliflower cut up to save time. I'm not playing no games tonight. It's game night too. I'm trying to chill and catch a vibe real quick. So I'm going to show you guys how I make this as well. I'm not going to be frying this. I'm going to be baking it because I don't need all of those calories. But let's get into it. Now this is important right here. So since I'm not frying it and I'm baking it on a tray, I got to put some oil on the tray so it doesn't stick. Cause then I'll just be eating aluminum foil wings. So I'm gonna spread some on the tray so it doesn't stick. And then I'm gonna make the batter and then put it on top of there. Bake it on each side for about 15 minutes. And then we got the wings pretty much. Freeze. So y'all probably wondering what I put inside the flour. Don't worry, I got y'all. I just put some turmeric for color, sea salt, pepper, and a little bit of minced onion. Now back to the video. And I'm just gonna stir it until it gets to a batter. And there you got it, your batter with no eggs. Who says you need eggs again? So now we start, I know this is crazy how I have to crouch, I know, chill. So now we start the three step process of grabbing the cauliflower, putting it in the flour, battering it up, and then putting it on the tray. Got the cauliflower, put it in the batter. Get it nice and coated. And then you add it on the tray. And you repeat the same process until all your cauliflower or broccoli is coated. So for example, with this broccoli, I'm gonna do the same. And I like to use both broccoli and cauliflower because they just have different unique tastes. This is how they're gonna look once they're coated, guys, the broccoli and the cauliflower. So now I'm just gonna preheat the oven to 425 and bake them for 15 minutes on each side and flip them. Why not? Yo, what are you guys doing in my, oh my gosh, man. Since y'all want to play games, I'm baking y'all too. And I'm putting it on broil, 500. A few moments later. <laughs> now nah, I'm just joking. I wouldn't bake you guys, cause I mean, then who would watch the video? Anyway, man, back to the ranch. Let's get it. So quick recap. Recap, what am I? <laughs> quick recap. So, so far we put in the cashews, the dill, chives, garlic. Next, I'm gonna put in the onion. I had to give you guys a little recap because I know how you YouTube consumers are. You guys have attention spans like gerbils. No offense, but. Drop the onion in there. Squeeze the lemon juice in there. This is essential. It gives it a nice kick. Next, I'm gonna add my pink Himalayan sea salt and the pepper. 
now I'm gonna add the almond milk. Not too much. So this is how it looks when it's done. Now all I have to do is coat it. I flipped it about 15 minutes in between and then nice and crispy like some buffalo wings, not all. I got my sauce right here, my barbecue sauce that I picked up today. I put some brown sugar in it to make it like honey barbecue sauce. I'm about to drop these in there and swirl it around. Next up guys, I got the red hot sauce. So you can choose to put it in a separate bowl, but I'm just gonna put it on top of what's left of the barbecue. That's just what I like doing. Feel free to do whatever you wanna do. So just dump it all in there. And it is literally the same process. Dump everything in there and stir it around. Boom, this is the final result. This is how I make my honey barbecue, cauliflower and broccoli wings, as well as my hot wings. And of course we got the vegan ranch sauce that I showed you guys how to make from scratch. This is a really good entry dish to people who are thinking about going plant-based or vegan. And you can't really tell the difference, honestly. It, it's crunchy, it has all the flavor, it tastes exactly like wings, and it is so delicious. Time for the taste test. Look at that, hold up. Thumbnail. <laughs> right, first time I tried the uh, hot. Mm -hmm. Guys. I used to love Buffalo Wild Wings. And since choosing this lifestyle, I was worried that I couldn't have wings anymore, but this is a great substitute. Look at that, you real quick. It was at this moment Dudley knew the ranch would never leave the corner of his lips. Mm. Y'all gotta try this, man. This ranch is delicious. If you don't mind, I'm gonna get down to business. I love you guys, thanks for tagging along. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Hold up. Before you go, let me try one of these honey barbecue joints. Mmm. Mmm. It's not fried and it's just as good. It's amazing. I highly recommend that you guys try this out. Let me know down below in the comment section what you think. And I'll see you guys in the next video, man. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Stay blessed.